Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys. And today guys, I will be showing you how to export your theme in Google Slides. So yeah guys, make sure to watch the quick and easy video till the very end, follow my steps correctly. So you can make sure this works the same for you and that you can do this yourself. But yeah guys, let's get straight into it. The first thing you want to do guys is go ahead to the official Google Slides website and log into your account. After logging into your account guys, you can go ahead and create a presentation. As you can see, I have already created a presentation right here and here I have some slides that I'm going to use. So guys, let's say that you want to create a specific theme that you want to be able to use in the future. So guys, I'm going to be showing you how to do that and it's very easy. The first thing you want to do guys is go ahead and create your first slide or multiple slides if you want and edit them how they want to look. So the next thing we want to do is go ahead into the theme editor. We need to do that by clicking the view option right here in the upper corner. Here click on view and then click on team builder. Go ahead and click on team builder guys and now you can see this opens up this new page where you can edit your theme and your layouts. So if you change your theme, this will change the theme for the whole presentation. So here you want to put how you want your edit theme uh, style to look like. Uh, here you can use your heading, you can put it bolded or whatever you want. Just look, make it look however you want guys and edit it to your preferment. So guys, after you're finished and you have saved all of your layouts, then you uh, in the main theme, you want to go ahead and save this presentation. You can go ahead and do this by clicking the file option right here and then go ahead and click the download button and you want to download it guys as a microsoft powerpoint so go ahead and click on microsoft powerpoint guys and now you can go ahead and as you can see it will get downloaded you can change the name so you can remember that this is the theme that you want to use in the future so the next time you want to use this theme guys to create a new presentation you can just open up this original one and work on that on it then so yeah guys, that's how you do it basically, I hope this video was helpful, if it was, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. So yeah guys, thank you for watching, take care and bye.